Hello there, this is Alistair Goodell from GT Driving School here. Uh, doing one of my very first videos of the Ashford Test Centre and Test Routes. Uh, this is, I am currently sitting at the Test Centre with all the various driving school or DVSA bays in front of me. Uh, this is where your test would start and finish uh, and it's at the Civic Centre in the middle of uh, the town centre and uh, it's a little bit unusual in comparison to many other places which are dedicated place um, centres but this is part of the Civic Centre. So we're going to start here and we're going to do a, a video up to uh, and including the roundabout just outside the uh, outlet centre, Ashford Outlet Centre. So without any further ado, here we go. So, just getting myself into gear, I'm looking left and right, and we're going to move off from this direction to the right. You, If you're parked in the DVSA car parking spaces, you will be moving off to the left. But I'm just moving, I'm in the opposite bays, so I'm going to be turning right. So I'm just checking left and right again, gently moving on, and here we go. Round we are. <coughs> Just following the arrows, a little bit lumpy around here, and then back out again where it says out, oddly enough. Now we're going to turn left here, so I've checked mirrors indicated downwards, pausing just to check left and right. The road is very slow, it's actually a 15 mile an hour unusual 15 you don't really see anywhere but this one does have a proper speed limit sign and says 15 miles an hour we have a few lumps and bumps in the road just to get over and we're just gently moving our way round and keep on going round keeping it under the 15 and then we end up at the front of the Civic Centre and we just continue round and up to the main road now the route that we're going to take is at, uh, to our left at the main road so I'm just checking my main and right mirrors to get past this large car then I'm going to check main and left indicating downwards and back over to the left keeping on the left hand side the road can be a little bit busy so we're going might have to wait a while but we're going to pause I'm checking over my right shoulder there's a bus in some distance away but he's okay and we're just going to move on it's now gone from 15 to 30 miles an hour and we're just taking our time bit of a queue of traffic up ahead <clears throat> we're going straight ahead The single lane of traffic sort of um, there is a single lane that then turns into two lanes there's one on the right hand side goes off to the shared space area uh, which we will do another video of at some point and then my, la my lane will move, um, split into two if you've got two lanes going in the same direction always try and keep in the left lane <clears throat> at the moment everybody seems to be turning left possibly to pick up um, people from Ashford International but we've got green lights and we're just moving on up the road keeping in the left lane moving on over the hill so over the railway back down the other side we're in the left of the three lanes which is where we want to be We've got green arrows still, people waiting at the crossing, carrying on round, still a 30 mile an hour, keeping on the left, but you can see the 40 is just up ahead, so I'm just checking around, keeping it under 30, now checking around, a little bit of gas, and we're off, we're off to 40 miles an hour. Up ahead is the Ashford Outlet Centre just a little bit of traffic and we've got green arrows green lights looking good 
we we're going to go through because we wouldn't have been able to stop. And carrying on through. It's still a faulty. Now triangle signs telling us that there is a roundabout up ahead and we're going to turn right. So I'm going to check main and right, indicate right and move into the right hand lane. So I'm looking around again, making sure everything's okay. So I'm going to be turning right at the third exit at this roundabout. So I'm checking main and right, indicating right, slowing it down, gently braking. Keeping my distance from the car in front, at least tyres and tarmac. I want to see the tarmac of the uh, between the tyres of the car in front. Nice distance behind him, so that the red car can move off. I can now look at the roundabout and think, yep, nobody coming. Because I'm turning right, I'm keeping on the inside of the roundabout, taking the third exit. I've gone past the first. Now gone past the second. Now I'm checking main and left, indicating left, and going out. To take the third. <clears throat> the speed limit has gone from 40 down to 30 now. And we're moving on. And we're just going to take the <clears throat> next roundabout and we're going to turn left. So main and left, indicating left. Looking to the right, all oh, looks good. We can carry on round. And we're just going to end up in this car park. So round to the right. Now we've got a five mile an hour speed limit, nice and gentle. Around we go, and we'll find somewhere to stop. A little bit further on. And I'm going to do a forward bay park to the right. So I'm just checking where my reference points are, right locking it. Moving into the space, and there we go, stopping there. Thank you, see you next time.